Welcome back to some more Power World. Yeah, boy. And today, it's finally happening. The ultimate Tiefen is going to be created. We've been planning this since, like, what? Day one, day two? As soon as we caught a Tiefen and found out we could breed and mash and mush things together, we were like, yeah, we're going to create the ultimate Tiefen. A cute little healing elephant we're going to make powerful and strong. So we've been prepping for this for a while. We've caught over 150 Tiefens. We've got lucky ones. We've got alpha ones. We've been getting good skill ones. And now we've built the breeding base. So the breeding base has been going well. We was chilling here last night making a bunch of cakes. Uh, I just did some of the creatures that were in here. So we've now got two cows instead of one because milk was the thing we was lacking behind, which was a little bit weird. But yeah, we got the, the blaze house that are cooking our cakes up. They do that really quick. Um, everything's just going well. So let me just go show off real quick. In here, we've got 18 cakes, which means we can breed 18 times, which hopefully should be enough. Um, in here then, uh, what we're going to do, we're just going to sort. So the way we're going to be doing this is we need to breed up Tiefens. So let me just use you, for example, with four of the best passive skills. So I know I need Lucky because that gives you more attack. I think there's like a Ferocious that gives an attack. There's like a Hooligan that gives an attack. So anything that gives us attack power is what we want. We want this number to be as high as possible. Defense, health, work speed, sanity, whatever. We don't care for. We just want to make a Tiefen as strong as possible. So we're going to have to go through all of these. Um, I mean, first off, we should find the lucky one. I mean, there's the lucky one just there. If we go to you, work speed and attack goes up 15%. Now... This is the first time we've done breeding. I'm sure all of you are going to tell me what I'm doing wrong and right. What I do want to just say is we're only breeding Tiefens. I keep getting comments on, hey, actually you should breed this creature and this creature because it gives you this legendary creature. I don't want to do that yet. I want to kind of find most of these legendaries in the wild. I don't want to breed them together. So we're only doing Tiefens. Stop, stop commenting about all the combos. I know that it's a, it's a thing. We might do that at some point. But for now, it's just Tiefens. Um, so, I believe we can breed out by that botanical barrier thing, but we'll see. So, you are a female, so we're going to need a boy. So, what we do, we pop you in here, we lift with V. We had an update this morning. God damn, you're so big. Look at you, you're so big. We, update, we pick you up with V, and now we throw you with V instead of all the Fs and all the stuff. So, you're in there. Now, we need a male with... Uh, a good stat we want to breed into. So, uh, let's have a look. Serious? I don't think that's anything. That's work speed. Don't care for that. Uh, Hooligan, I think, is one. It is. All right. Do we have, though, Ferocious somewhere? Because that's a big... Wow, you were awful. That's a big, strong one. Musclehead. Oh, Musclehead's a good one, right? Plus 30 attack. Okay. Uh, that's a female, though. I must remember I've got muscle head. Come on. Where is my ferocious one? Uh, another muscle head. Ferocious. There we go. Uh, so, yeah. 20 attack. And you are a male, which is what we want, right? Yes. Perfect. Okay. So, we pop you in here. All right. So, we can then also do muscle head and whatever the other 10 percent attack was. Yeah. Nice. Okay. Let's throw you in here. And you two should get to work. Nice. They're breeding. Cool. Sick. So what we can do, they drop an egg and then we just hatch it and hope that it's got both them skills in. Um, and then we'll breed that with, I guess, the muscle head one. So what we should probably do is find that one again, which is you. Uh, let's pop you all the way at the end. So I know. Uh, let's do that with another one. Uh, what else we got? So there's a muscle head. Another ferocious. Hooligan, I think, is what we want. Yeah. Hooligan, just for that extra attack. So let's also chuck you at the end. So hopefully we get a male out of this. But we'll see. So um, some adjustments I've made just for today. Egg hatching speed is zero. So as soon as we get an egg, we can just hatch it. That's just going to stop us waiting around. Because we do have to wait around for the breeding. Just take a little bit of a, a while. So um, yeah. Now we just chill out and just wait for an egg to come. And it should be that simple. So... I guess before we do jump in any further, if you do enjoy today's episode, make sure you are whacking a like. Make sure you are subscribing. You ring the bell. Never a notification. Follow the social medias. I do appreciate all the support on Power World. I keep saying it every episode, but I love this game. 
and it's nice to see a new game do well on the channel so a big huge thank you to everyone that's been here um i do appreciate it massively if you do want to go support the channel that little bit more and you've got the means to you can become a channel member or a patron by the way we do have a patreon power world server i might even be doing a members power world server at some point so you know it's just a little perk of supporting the channel again thank you i appreciate you all okay let's wait for this egg then and uh hopefully first try we get all the stats that we want well there's a first egg and damn egg so we are looking for a ferocious and a lucky teethant from here preferably a male as well so if we go boom hold incubate because like i said we've just done that setting so this speeds things up a little bit and we only got a lucky one okay so you guys just do it again so we just got to keep going until we got lucky and ferocious i'm gonna try and do this so we don't have that other one he's got the botanical whatever it is i think that's gonna make things a little easier in the future um okay but first one unsuccessful all right next egg is ready everyone fingers crossed uh, a male with whatever we're looking for ferocious and lucky passive traits um oh we have ferocious and muscle head which we didn't actually... You didn't have muscle head, right? Huh. And you also got... So now that dude has four passive stats, you can also just get a random passive stat. I have no idea where in the box you will be. Uh, it's not them two. Cool. Um, organization is not good right now. Uh, I guess it just fills in a hole somewhere. Yeah, I don't know. Um, That one had like... All sorts of things that we didn't want huh okay this might be a little bit more difficult than we thought all right we'll give it another one we'll see what happens there so we're literally looking for a baby with just looking ferocious because that's what these have all right this is the one this this is the egg that's gonna give us what we want right everyone cross your fingers cross your toes cross your nipples cross your eyes anything else you can cross do it because uh ferocious lucky what wait ferocious is what we want right but then we've still got the other stuff. So, um, hmm. How does that work? Do we stop them breeding? Oh, and I'm going to find that dude in here, right? <laughs> I should have moved these all around. Are you going to be at the end now, finally? Nope. I have. Oh, it was this one just here. Okay, let me just grab you, chuck you towards the end here. So, you've got ferocious lucky which that's what we wanted vanguard we don't want so we need to get rid of vanguard and botanical barrier um okay we can't like just delete that right so can we now breed this one with because you're a male right with one of these i think we can right and then hopefully one of them just replaces it or something. Okay. Um, I don't know why I picked you up. I didn't need to do that. I just needed to put you away. But thank you, lucky giant Tiefen. Okay, let's try this. Remember, this is the first time I've done this. Um, <laughs> if it all goes wrong, then it goes wrong. It is what it is. So we took you guys away. We're going to put you in here. All right. And boom. So we're going to be looking for a ferocious and a lucky mixed with whatever we give it like muscle head or something they chuck you in there so we want to get rid of vanguard and the the barrier so first egg between these two uh so ferocious lucky muscle head is that what we're looking for i've, I've already forgot <laughs> i wish breeding was a little bit quicker and let's see we literally just got vanguard wow okay I honestly thought this was going to happen a little bit quicker. But apparently it's not. So Lucky... Oh, you had Vanguard. Oh, okay. I thought that was a complete random one. Lucky, Ferocious, Musclehead. Dudes. Come on. Next one. Make sure you put that baby stuff together and, and make what we want, okay? Because it's just going to speed things up here. Because we all want to see how strong one of you guys are actually going to be. And we are back. And our Tiefen, we've got all the skills on it. It took um let me calculate this five hours uh we made some mistakes that i'm probably sh uh, sure some of you are gonna correct me on but i'll show you 
kind of how this worked. So let's go towards the end. So originally, we bred like... I don't even know where we started. Muscle head. Uh, maybe with this. Like, we was just getting some weird combinations. Um, we had to restart again. So what I did, I got as like uh, a female with muscle head and a male with lucky. Bred them together to get a baby with like this. Muscle head and ferociousness. Pretty much, we weren't allowed to have a baby that had a random stat in there, if this makes any sense. So, like, right here, this was perfect. We had Ferocious, Muscle Head, Lucky. We bred that up with the Hooligan. That works perfect. But when we got stuff like this, Muscle Head, Runner, Blood of Dragon, or I think we had, like, this uh, Bitonical Garden thing going on. It, yeah, you have to have just the stats you want, and then when that baby comes out, it has to have just the stats you want. Don't go for the fragrant foliage and blood of dragon and try and breed out. It takes way too long. <laughs> Trust me. So, what we have then is we're going to party. We have this Tiefen just here, um, and we have Ferocious plus 20% attack, Muscle Head plus 30% attack, Lucky plus 15% attack, and Hooligan plus 15% attack. So all together, what is that? 50, 60%? I think we're 60% more attack than a normal Tiefen would have. Now, I didn't want this to start leveling up, but we're getting passive levels from shit doing stuff. Because what I wanted to do is actually grab a Tiefen with no skills at all. Uh, do we have one that's got absolutely nothing like this? Let's pop you instead of Nox for now. So we're going to have this one. And this one, we're going to compare them uh, when we do like a little fight or something. And we can just kind of show off the different strengths. But yeah, breeding, it's um, it's a little longer than I thought it would be. Even with the no timer on the egg hatching. But yeah, for you that that want to do breeding, and I'm sure the comments will stay the same now. Just breed with the passive skills you want. If there's an extra one on there, throw it away. And when you go out catching stuff... Um, I mean, like, I don't know. We kind of got lucky because I managed to breed this into this somehow. Like, oh, man, it's it's not complicated. It's just a lot of hard work. So next up, then, we are going to kind of smush up all of these Tiefens now. Now, this is only going to give it some, um, what's it called? Not a passive skill. What is this, like, actual skill called? The Soothing Shower. It's just going to put that up to the max level, which only heals us. It doesn't really do anything, but I want this as the strongest teeth that we can possibly get. So we click on you, and we're just going to start smushing all of these together. So boom. Actually, do we get stat increase? I think we do, right? Um, I should have checked, but he's currently uh, a one star. So let's go again. We need 16 of these. Oh, yeah, it does actually improve his skills. Good shit. All right, and another box here. I might try and... Actually, not screw it. We'll do that. So that's going to put that dude up. Get level three onto there. Begin. Perfect. He's become stronger. Oh, yeah. This is this is going good. This is going nicer. All right, we need 32 of these now. Wish I could just select them all. Uh, boom, 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 boom. We had 177 in our inventory, by the way. 177 Tiefens is what we got. And boom. There we go again. All right, so he's already a free star. I think this is the final. We need 64, and I think we should have enough. And then what we can do is sell the rest of the Tiefens. And I'm like double clicking on some. We have so many. So how many was that all together? 64 plus 32. I can't remember what the second one was. Plus like 14 or something. Uh, you definitely need well over 100. There's that done. We now have a full, full four star. So already, I know okay, there's only two levels different, but already this has 334 attack, whereas this one only has 147. In terms of health, it's got 300 more, and then obviously defense, yeah, it doesn't matter too much, but there's a 30 difference. And even in work speed, actually our work speed is terrible because we've got all the minus the bad sides of um, Hooligan and whatever else. Right, one more thing we could do to strengthen our Tiefen up is... Oh, oh, I can level up this as well. Hell yeah, perfect. I pressed the wrong button, but here we go. So, we click onto you. Uh, so, we don't have any of these big ones, so we won't be able to max this dude out. But what we can do here is start using these PAL spheres that you get from just killing stuff. And I'm just going to max out his attack 
its health and we may as well do its defense i'll focus more on the attack but we can get all of them into the purple so that gives that plus 12 percent plus fit uh plus 12 again we only have eight of these so i'll just put everything we can which is just that okay we may as well just go the last ones into health and defense so as of now that's as strong as we can make our teeth in until we get some more of these medium ones and some of these large ones. Let me know where we find them because I actually don't know. I think we just... You get them from on, on the ground and killing stuff, right? I'm not sure if we get them from bosses, but we've never even got one of these gold ones. Okay. So, if we go into our party now. So, we've got level 15 or level 13, sorry. 412. So, originally, it would have been 229. We've, like, practically doubled that. And now what we've got to do is start leveling this up to get even stronger. But if we're looking at this one, 154, 412. That's so much stronger. Uh, let me have a look at, like, Catrus. 506, which normally it would be 440, but this is a level 34. So, my Tifa might get stronger, which is crazy. Nice. Okay, um, let's head out. Let's go fight some stuff. Uh, where do I want to fight? What are we going to... You know what? I guess go to the desert. Or the volcano, in fact. Or shall we go and fight this monkey, rabbit, green grass dude? Because boss leveling will give us a bunch, right? And I think Catris could take this on. Uh, what are we looking like in terms of ammo and stuff? Not too much, but we can do this. All right. So we're not going to use Tiefen just yet. We're just going to do this to get some levels. Because you get passive levels and stuff. Alright, Mr. Weird Rabbit Guy. Who I just don't like. For some reason, I just don't like this dude. Alright, boom, boom, boom. Alright, keep doing fire attacks, Catrus. That's good. Okay. Some headshots. Yeah, that's it. Good shit, Catrus. I kind of do want to throw Tiefen out right now. Just to see how much damage we'll do. They're not strong enough yet. They're not high enough level. Alright, missing all my shots. Uh, my weapon just broke. Titties. I didn't even know that was um, that close to breaking. Alright. This is fine. That's what we have a crossbow for. Doesn't do much damage. Jesus Christ. Okay. Bullet. Seed bullet kicking. Whatever it's doing. Alright, he's on fire. He's nearly dead. Catrus, a few more attacks, please. And that should be it. Nice. Okay, so there we go. Both Tiefens are already 25 and 24. Why did you surpass his level? Hmm. Interesting. Because this was a high level to begin with. Is that just so we can catch up? Uh, we're at 547. Okay. Uh, also, they learn some attacks. We'll have to go through their attacks as well and give them some good. We could also use a skill fruit and give it a special, um, like, move, a special ability, which might be cool. All right. Boom. You know what? We could actually use our Tiefen here. Let's do it. They're the same level. Good, Tiefen. Show us what you're made of. All right, let's see what they're going to do. Bubble Blast. I mean, like, this is technically not meant to be a fighter. Okay, Tiefen, come here. Look at you, you beautiful little creature. Okay, there's another gorilla. Let's go fight him. Are you ready? I think you're ready. Okay, let's go. So this is meant to be a healer. So if we ever get nearly dead, we use it to heal us. But now, we're using it to kick butt. All right, so I did 263 of headshots. Tiefen, do an attack. What are you going to do? Bubbles again? Okay. All right. And yeah, do that water sprout thing. Dirt, just 401. Okay. Shoot in the face. Go on, do another attack. Don't do the bubbles. Do something else. Okay. I mean, if all of them hit, that's a good 600 damage, right? Okay. Uh, is there another monkey? Because we could swap out to our other Tiefen and kind of compare. Yeah, there's another monkey to set. All right. So this is the weaker one. So that one, remember, was doing a few hundred damages. Okay. Here come the bubbles. Yeah, that's only doing 50s. That's crazy. So we're doing way more damage. All right, Tiefen, get him. Here we go. So it was doing just 50 damage last time. Here we go. 120, 130, 140s. That's wild. Okay. 
So we do also have the ability to change these. Hydro Jet. Power's only 30. Sandblast is 40. All right, you know what? Real quick. Let's just get home. Let's see what power skill fruits we have. Because they act as, um, like... Why did I go in there? <laughs> I don't want to be in here. They act as Pokemon TMs. I don't know why. I was I was thinking about so many different stuff. Uh, we need to go here and teleport home. So in one of these boxes is a skill fruits. Uh, I think it's one of these, actually. Not that one. Okay, I don't have as much as I thought. But we could literally teach any of these to Tiefen and give it, like, an electrical attack. The power's 90 on that. Uh, we've got a grass one. I kind of like this Try lightning Okay, let's give it a, a lightning attack just for pure shits and giggles. A powerful move. Um, how do we do this? I'll right click. Use on you. Nice. Okay. So now we're going to you. Change this. There we go. Okay. I didn't care about them trees. Because I've seen them all over the place. Uh, I know there's one near the start somewhere. I think it's up here, right? We're going to go and have a look and see if there's like a strong water attack up there. Tiefen, go, go, go and fight this. Do your electrical attack. I want to see how strong it is. Oh, no, it's just going to do bubbles again. <laughs> oh, he gets prone back so much. Okay, uh, yeah, these trees up here drop these skill plants, the skill fruits. So let's go and see if there's anything spicy. We definitely have to keep at least one water thing for you. Uh, you know what? Let's just go fly up there. But maybe there's like a really strong water one. Uh, where have I seen the others? There's one that's like in a little cave thing somewhere. And I forget whereabouts that is. Uh, that looks like a water one just there. Uh, what are we saying? Bubble Blast. Okay. Uh, bubble Blast is a rare one. 65 damage. Okay. Uh, oh, can I not use... Do you know Bubble Blast? Oh, you do? Okay. Okay, interesting. What were the other ones we got? Um, Stone Cannon. Or Air Cannon. That's not very strong. Stone Cannon's pretty powerful. Okay. What we're going to do then is probably keep coming back and checking them. Every now and then. Just in case there is like a really strong water attack. I don't know what attacks are best. I've not really played around with them too much, so maybe you guys let me know. What should we be teaching, Tiefen? Is it good to have a different element attack, or should we just stick with water? Uh, there's the Shillay up here. Let's go and fight this. Okay, you. Tiefen, let's go. Do a little shoot on you. Go on, do your electric attack. I believe in you. I was doing it. 220, 194, and 184. Look all that damage it's done already on it. Now the bubbles. Bro, just imagine we did this with, um, I don't know, Catrus. <laughs> imagine like this guy. I'm going to guess he's a big strong boy. That's going to be crazy. Or oh, actually, this dude's meant to be like the most OP guy. Maybe we catch a bunch of him at some point and then do the same that we've done to Tiefen. Oh, yeah, so look, here's the small power soul. So we're finding these, like, on the ground, which is the first one we found today. I'm sure you get them from killing certain dudes as well. Uh, it might tell us. Uh, like, do we get them from you? No. Does anyone drop power souls at all? Uh, doesn't look like it. Oh, you do? Okay. This one also drops Suspicious Juice and Strange Juice. That is interesting. Uh, Alright. So the Tombat does? I'm not seeing, like, anything else that does. Hmm. Maybe we'll have to have a little look around online. Are you just a regular common egg? Uh, you sure are. Alright, I feel like we need to do another boss to test out teeth and strength. Um, let's go... I mean, we could do a quick dungeon run. Nah, that'd be too easy, man. That'd be way too easy. Alright, let's go fast travel. What have we not done? A level 31. Uh, what's this one? 
31, but that's an electric. Let's not do that. Level 30. Level 25. That could be a good one, actually. That might be perfect. We've got any over here we're not doing. 38. You're 38. All right, I guess we go to this one, which I believe is in a cave or a tunnel, right? I think we have to go behind the waterfall. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, this dude's behind the waterfall. So, again, we're not going to catch this one. We're just going to fight this with Tiefen. Oh, hello, chest. Do you have any power souls for me? No. Got a lot of uh, coins, though. I also kind of really want to get really badly hurt so we can see what the healing power of Tiefen's like. Because we buffed that. It doesn't say anywhere, right? Just a level 5 soothing shower. Like, it's not... I'm, I'm going to guess it, like, instantly heal us. I really don't want my armor to be damaged too much. All right, let's see what's going on here. So here we go. Uh, a feng, feng lope. Tiefen. Where, where are you? You know what? Let's put you back. Yeah. Get him, Tiefen. Show him who's boss. I'll do a little, a little help for you. Okay, so it does a lot less damage against the boss. That's okay. Get him, Tiefen. Water blast. Nice. Don't stand in the poison, though. Right, and all the water bubbles, the electric as well. I don't know, Tiefen seems to uh, attack very fast. Is that because we've leveled him up or something? Oh, careful. Okay, uh, yeah, yeah, come after me. So, so far, I've done a few little shots doing 30 damage. Tiefen's been doing all that damage. They're the same level. Tiefen's practically a boss, is what we're saying right now. You know what would be awesome? If we could breed all of them stats and stuff into a Lucky or an Alpha one. There we go. That was all Tiefen. That really was. Um, Come here. What a little god. What an actual little god. Okay, what we're going to do then to finish off is we'll go fight someone else again. Compare how good Tiefen is to how good the one with all the non-stats and stuff are. Uh, let's just have a quick look here, though. So right now we're at 570, when normally we'd be at 317. Yours is only 222. All right, Catrus is 506. Is eight levels higher? So what would we say? 506? This is 570. This isn't even a natural high stat attack creature, which is wild. I can only imagine... All of them passive skills, all of them souls, all the condensing on a Catrus. That's definitely my next, um, like, creature to breed up, maybe. All right, let's get out of here. Let's just go see the damage numbers on, I don't know, whatever we find out and about around here. And then, yeah, we'll switch out to the non-strong one. Do a little comparison. I can't see dicks. So we do have Relaxosaurus around here. They're nice, big, strong boys. Uh, there is another one over there. Okay, that's what we're going to go for. So let's do you first. All right. Do some damage. Let's see. Electric stuff. 800. Wait, was that super effective? 800 damage? God damn. I kind of wanted you to just do a war attack. All right, let's fight this one. This is a little bit stronger. Tiefen, go get them. I've not got many arrows left. Uh, five, three, eight. It's not saying it's super effective anywhere, though. Electric isn't good against dragon. Ice is. Huh. Okay. Um, let me go and find... I need to find something that is not going to be super effective again, so we can nice and easily compare stuff. Uh, I'm not going to go and help you guys. I mean, this might work. All right, Tiefen. We fight one of these. All right, just damage them. All right, you missed that. That's good. I need you to do a water attack on it, please. Oh, God, they're all after us. All right, here we go. Water bubbles. 200. All right, so now we switch out to you. Okay, so this is one with no skills. Let's do a 90. 280, some are there. Okay. Definitely, like, at l I mean, double the strength, for sure. All right. Heal me. 
I am slightly injured. There we go. We're fully healed. <laughs> Amazing. Good shit, Tiefen. Good freaking shit. Okay. Uh, let's grab this. There's also a chest over there I want to grab before we get out of here. So you're level 26. What we will be doing, obviously, between episodes, I'll be going around and fighting all these bosses again. Getting some levels. So hopefully, by the time we record next, you're on par with Catrus and all that. I mean, for one last thing, shall we go and take on this camp and show your strength? Are you ready for this, Tiefen? This is going to be your biggest test. Um, Okay, they just planted themselves in the ground. <laughs> All right, let's go take on this boss. We've got um, 23 arrows. So this is all going to be... It's all going to be you. All right. I'll, I'll shoot him in the face. Nice. I didn't even see them. Good job. <laughs> okay, let's go see what we can save from here. Look at him just running around. Who would have thought that this is the ultimate powerful creature? If I go into like a... a what, what would you call Like a trainer battle... And I sent this out. People would laugh. Until they got hit with the electric attack for sure. Alright, Tiefen, let's go. Are they grenading everyone? The only bad thing about that electric thing is you have to stand still. Oh god. Oh god. Okay, there we go. So yeah, definitely gonna have to find maybe something better than the electric. Tiefen, come on. Keep it up. There we go. Ah! Frame throwers! Frame throwers! Please get them first, Tiefen. This is all you. I'll do a little shot on them. Come on. Jesus! Okay. Hey, leave my little elephant alone. Nope. Don't want grenades in my face. Thank you very much. I mean, Tiefen's taking them on. There's the electric to kill them. Did you do it? Good stuff. Nice. You're still a lower level. Than the one that was lower level to begin with. All right, let's get big sad sea serpent out of here. There you go. Save you. Nice. All right. There we go. So, it took us all day, like literally all day, to do this, but we worked out the breeding. Um, like I tried to explain, just do singular ones into what you're breeding. If you've got, what, like, a stat or a passive skill you really don't want, it's going to be near impossible to breed it out of them. It is possible, but it's just going to take way longer. So just keep breeding until you get a creature with the two passive skills, then move that on to the next one that has one passive skill, so there should be three in total, and you put that on to the last one. Yeah, that's how it's done. And, uh, yeah, make sure you're taming a bunch of Tiefens. I believe we could have started with, like, a slightly better one, because all creatures have different stats. So... Say when we tamed this, captured this, it had like 20 attack points. There might be one in the wild that has 50 attack points beginning. So we could have had this even stronger. Oh, I just realized. Passive skills plus 80%. We got 80% more attack from all these skills. And I know there is a legendary one that has a bunch of attack as well. So there's potential that this is not the final version of Tiefen. But it's the final version one for now. God damn. God damn. Oh, I'm so glad we did this. I hope there's a fire boss somewhere so we can use you. All right. What we're going to do then is we're going to wrap it up, call it a day there. I am going to keep a lookout for them trees. I'm going to keep collecting the fruits. See if we can get this dude with a bunch of strong attacks. I know it will learn more as it levels up. Have you learned any more? Uh, I don't think so. No, probably not. But uh, yeah, let me know what attacks we should be putting on them. And... Um, yeah, there we go. Ultimate Tiefen. I feel like we need to give them a name as well. Name suggestions. Whack them down in the comments. All right. So we'll wrap it up. Call it a day there. If you enjoyed it, make sure you whack in a like. Make sure you subscribe and you ring the bell. Never notifications. Thank you very much for hanging out. I'll catch you all in a bit. See you later.